Hi Brew House and welcome back to my channel. As usual, it's your girl Moki, the Pastel Brew House, aiding you on your spiritual journey, one pastel post, podcast, YouTube video, however I can get it to you at a time. And welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to share with y'all a very special, quick, easy, simple money drawing spell. Yes, that's right. Money drawing, a way to bring money your way. And all of not most of the surprise the supplies is from pressed so if you're local here to Fayville you can find basically everything you need for this spell at pressed and the stuff that you can't find at pressed you should be able to find pretty easily I will be sharing some things you can use to like ump the ump pump up the magic if you will a little bit more but for the most part what you need is a green chime or mini magic candle that they sell at press and they sell them at poof, a lot of other places as well you can get them on amazon or yeah amazon i'm pretty sure they sell them at walmart maybe maybe not this small but point is a small tapered candle and if you can see you can see i've kind of like wrote things on the candle i've just used a pen so to carve that in so what you want to do is you want to write your name or whoever's name that this candle is intended for and then you want to write how you want to bring this money to you whether it be a promotion just looking for someone to give you the money uh you want to make that big sale you want to have the uh, your you want to start your own business whatever that may be you want to write it down on the candle I also sometimes write things just like financial security, financial stability, like just to keep the money coming my way. Like just, it doesn't have to be as goal oriented where you have to write your goals down. You can just write that you want to start making money and make smart choices with your money. Whatever you want this spell to bring you, write down on the candle. Then you're going to take, like I said, this is something that you might not be able to find but i have some yandy's libra oil that i like to use for my personal spells so what i'm going to do is i am going to take some of this oil and just pour it on the candle we don't need a lot okay we just need a little bit and we're just gonna cover the candle with the oil boom simple easy right now i also have here from my grandmother's stash some come to me powder and some steady word powder which is harder to find and you can probably find it on etsy or your local botanica but it's a powder a very fine powder And you're just going to take it and sprinkle it. I hope I'm in frame, yes. Sprinkle it around the candle. It's okay if some of it falls into that dish because this is the dish that we're going to actually put the candle in when it burns. This is that steady work powder. You can also use money drawing powder, uh, open road powder for all of my brew house, but or Aubrey Camino, if you will, but I'm using what I have on hand at the moment. I do need to restock my powders next time I go home to visit, or I just need to go figure out if I can order some somewhere. But we have that. Now, some gold glitter. So if you don't have any of those three things, don't feel like your candle's gonna be naked, Grab some glitter. It could be green glitter, gold glitter, copper glitter, uh, any color glitter that money is colored. So we're just gonna sprinkle this, which I honestly, this is the part I hate the most because the glitter, I like to try to keep in the dish because once it gets on everything, it's over. So now we have that. Now what we're going to do we're going to just burn a little bit of the wax at the bottom so that we get our candle to stay in the dish properly. Uh, uh, uh. So yeah, we're trying to avoid that from happening, draws. So we're just gonna 
And let it, oof, it's like you have to be very quick with it. Come on, little candle. There you go. Oh! You're killing me, Jimmy. So once you got your candle to stick in your dish by light lighting the bottom of it, you can take some herbs. I got these from... You guys saw the unboxing of the Holy Sans Hill Herb Kit, but we now sell them individually in the store Well, at Pressed. And you can buy individual packs of herbs. I would recommend for Money Spell to use catnip because even if you see here on the back, it says used in spells to attract love and money. Another one I would recommend is alfalfa, but for some reason I cannot find my pack of alfalfa right now. So we're just going to... and sprinkle it over and around your candle it's okay if none of it sticks to your candle sometimes it will sometimes it won't so do that and then just take a moment to set the intention of the candle be good uh say thanks to spirit and universe and your guides and then light your candle And just like that, you are done. And if that is not quick, easy, and simple enough for you, I don't know what is, just light the candle. Obviously, keep your eye on it. <laughs> don't leave it unattended, but you don't really have to worry about it too much. You already set the attention, you've added all your herbs, your powders, your glitters, and you're good to go. So I hope you enjoyed this quick and easy spell video. As usual, stay beautiful, keep shining, and I will see y'all next time. Bye!